What are tips for entrepreneurs trying to acquire new clients? Tips for people who want to succeed and, and um, attain new clients. Number one, if you're just starting, adopt a work ethic like the bodegas in New York City. Do not have a close sign. Your potential client does not care that it's your aunt's birthday, doesn't care that it's your kid's birthday, doesn't care that there's a leak, doesn't care you never not, that you didn't do this or do that. Nobody gives a damn. Nobody cares. Just remember that. Okay? So I would tell you that number one, work really, really, really hard. Number two is understand who you are and who you're not. Okay? If you're working from your basement, you're not likely to get McDonald's as your first client. But you might get the hamburger joint down the block because the guy really likes you. And you'll get a chance with them, right? I would tell you to understand who you are and who you're not, right? Um, I think that those are two initial tips. And I'll give you, you know, believe in yourself. And believing in yourself is really, really, really important. It's from your core. Mm -hmm. It's not announcing, I believe in myself. Do you really believe that you have it? Do you really believe at your core that you can make it? I can look you in the face today and tell you my business is going to keep growing. Period. Period. Five years from now, if we're sitting here, I am a complete failure if my business isn't 20, 30, 50, 75% bigger than it is. But you know what it won't be? It won't be 500 times larger than it is now. You know why? Because I like to sleep in my bed. Because I like to go to the gym in my house every morning. Because it's really important to me to make up with my daughters half the my, I'm divorced, my kids are with me half the week. It's really important to me to make up with my daughters half the week. And you know what that means? I can't grow my business 500%. You know why? I'm not willing to be on a plane every single day to a different city. Will that change in 5, 10, 15 years as my daughters get older? Yes, because I'll be more willing to do it. You know what that means? I understand who I am. I cannot win business right now in Africa and Europe and Australia. You know why? Because I want to wake up with my daughters half the week. And because I like to wake up in my bed. And you know what that means? I can pretend I'm the best PR firm in Africa and Australia and Europe, but I'm not. You know why? Because somebody else will go to those places every day. Because there's somebody like me that says, I don't need to wake up with my kids every day. I don't care about sleeping in my bed every day. There's people in my business that are on the road 25 days a month. I don't want to do that. And so that means I understand who I am. I understand what I can do and what I can't do. It's also why my business, I think, has grown, because I now have people in the business who are able to go after business that I don't think I would win. They'd never let me today tell Evian your business sucks. You're sold next to tampons. I'd never be able to do that anymore. <laughs>